Hey y'all, it's me, Chandler. And today I figured I'd show y'all what I've kind of made over the years. Between washcloths and hats and then what I've been working on and recently finished. Sorry for the panting noise. My dogs just came in from outside. So yeah, let's get started. So I've by last week, I made three little washcloth towels. These three. No, no. There's, I'm going to show you individually. There's this one. Sorry. This one. This one. And I, I have more of that color, and I need to make more, but... After, like, you make three in a row, you kind of get tired of them. So, you don't really want to do one right then and there. And then, I'll show y'all washcloths next. Um, there is one that my grandma knitted and gave to me to sell, but I haven't sold it yet. But, I'm going to a craft show in a couple weeks. So, yeah. Um, yeah, bear with me. I did something to my back, so. And some of them still need their tails woven in and stuff. But there's this green one. This kind of rainbow colored one. And this, these pastel, I think. A rainbow one. And I try to do a shell. I try to do some type of border. I, I call it the shell border, but I don't know what it was. Um, and then there's this one. This one. This one. Granted, these aren't even all of them because there's some at my mom's still. I forgot, I didn't really think about doing a video till today because I've been on the couch. Sorry. And then there's this one. I'll get sidetracked a lot. Um, these two, which are, they're smaller, but I mean, figured you could use them as like in a playset or or people with smaller hands. Um, this is the one my grandma made. I kind of like how the orange is, how it kind of back and forth. Um, this one. Um, this one. And like some of these washcloths, you can tell where I've gone through a phase of doing like uh, the sh my the one I call shell border, then single crochet, then no border. So yeah, and then there's this one, another one of the rainbows, white or whatever I call it. I can't remember uh, that one. Which I like this one a lot. Um, this one, uh, this one, and this is actually made, oh gosh, I can't remember the name, but I made it over sp my spring break at my grandma's house, and because, she's, she's like, I've had this for years and I've never used it, so if you want it, you can have it, but I wanted something out of it, I was like, okay, she's like, I need a washcloth, yeah, she didn't even use it, she told me I could have them, so I said, okay, um, Oh goodness, sorry. Um, I'll do hats next. About this one. Um, it's about for maybe a toddler or something. These are kind of like my beginning hats, so like you can kind of hats that I recently made. You can tell where they're different and all that. But hey, no ones. Unless you're watching my video, you're not gonna know. So. There's that one, this one, and these are actually made out of Karen cakes, um, like the beginning ones, because I got a lot when they came out for my, when they came out the year they came out, I got a lot for my birthday and Christmas, because like they're, my birthday is in November and my Christmas is in December, obviously, so, um, and then I've got these little baby hats for like, I don't know. Newborns. So, yeah. There's 
oh, sorry. That one. Sorry, my dogs are loud. That one. Then this one. And then I've made three iPad cases. I probably should have made more because I feel like some people would have bought them. But there's this one. There's this one. Which, this one's kind of like firm though. Like, you can't. I mean, my, my iPad fits in it. I probably should have made it a little bit bigger. So, but I mean, my iPad will fit in it. Hang on. Oh, sorry, my back really hurts. So, but like, I mean. And I probably should put like, do like something up top or like a button or something to where it can kind of just like a, just do like a chain or something where it can go down and put a button like right here or something but I'll do that later. I probably won't sell these. I'll probably make more and then sell them. And then there's this one. Um, and I have two whips with me right now. Um, I've been home for a while today because I just couldn't handle my back at school. So I I'm on the couch as I went on YouTube and found out, found, like, the star of some, I can't remember it, but the crochet crowd did a tor tutorial on it, if I can talk. And that's what I've gotten so far, and I've, it's 4.44 now, and I started this at, like, 2, no, like, 1.30. So, I've been kind of going on and off. Oh my gosh, dogs. Sorry for them. They're just... Roxy, come here. Come here. Oh, come here. Hi, Clo Clo. Sorry. Let him. And then I have a blanket I've been working on. If you have Instagram, real quick. Real quick. If you have an Instagram, go follow C -Anti Crafts. Hang on, let me see if there, I don't think there is any, um, underscores or anything. But, um, sorry. I was not prepared, obviously. Um, it's me and my cousin's Instagram. It's C -N -T Crafts, no capital letters. And, um, we're trying to get more posts up on there and stuff and kind of find some things out but we've been really busy so we haven't really been able to really y'all sorry I got one scratch and one one to play sorry and so we're just trying to get back on track and everything and this blanket is actually on Instagram there's a picture of it and then there's two videos of me doing time lapses of it so yeah and I'll link the Instagram in the description box below so, ah, no, okay, good, I did it. Okay, this is what it looks like so far. Oh, let me get this one. It's about, I don't know, a little less than halfway, but I mean, I kind of. I like worked on it a lot and then got kind of tired of it and put it up and then I put it I'm like trying to get my stuff organized but it's not really doing it like I'm just, I'm just everything going on I haven't really been organized can't really do it because I'm on restrictions or something else other than my back and so I had projects like where my yarn stored it's a wardrobe so I um I put like on the bottom like projects that way like I don't have to search for them all the time except for washcloths I I leave them with the washcloth yarns because I mean I can just pull one out and redo it and like do a different one and still have a bunch because I mean washcloths are for me like the granny squares they're easy to pop out I can pop them out in like an hour or an hour and a half and so yeah I don't even know what I was saying but, um, oh, so I put that away, and 
my Chevron bag, which these bags are actually really good if you're going to have like a big blanket project like that. I want, I want to get a few more just in case, like, because like they can like be stacked in my closet now that my closet's more organized. And so, because I mean, I have two yarn bins that my, I got for Christmas from Santa and my grandma gave me for Christmas. And I mean, those are good too, but the way my, my closet's kind of small and those bags will just fit better up against the wall where they are. So, yeah. Sorry, my dog's being weird. <laughs> so, thank you for watching this video. If you haven't, please like the video and subscribe down below. I'm going to try to do more videos, but with me being in school and stuff, I'm just not really, I don't have the time, I've got homework, I'll try to spend time with my family, and um, yeah, so thanks for watching, I will see y'all later in the next video, so bye!